Norman Lloyd, the Emmy-nominated veteran actor, producer and director whose career ranged from Orson Welles' Mercury Theatre, Alfred Hitchcock's Saboteur and acting with Charlie Chaplin in Limelight to Saint Elsewhere, Dead Poets Society and The Practice, died May 10 in his sleep at his Los Angeles home. He was 106. A family friend confirmed the news to Deadline. During one of the famous Lloyd birthday celebrations, Carl Malden said, Norman Lloyd is the history of our business. Blessed with a commanding voice, Lloyd's acting career dates back to Orson Welles' Mercury Theatre Troupe, of which he was the last surviving member. He was part of its first production, 1937 a modern dress adaptation of Shakespeare's Julius Caesar on Broadway titled Caesar. He originally was cast in Welles' epic Citizen Kane and accompanied the director to Hollywood. When the filmmaker ran into his proverbial budget problems, Lloyd quit the project and returned to New York, later making his screen debut as the villainous spy who fell from the top of the Statue of Liberty in Alfred Hitchcock's Saboteur, 1942. Lloyd himself generously offered startup jobs to many well-known filmmakers, such as Billy Friedkin. On television, he directed most of Hitchcock's suspense pieces, winning a special mention for Alfred Hitchcock Presents from the Venice Film Festival in 1985, and starred on the NBC medical drama Saint Elsewhere. Showbiz and media figures we've lost in 2021 photo gallery Lloyd was in his late 60s when he was cast on NBC's Saint Elsewhere as Dr. Daniel Auschlander, a veteran physician who dealt with his own liver cancer diagnosis and chemo. He was with Boston Set Hospital Drama for its entire six-season run from 1982 to 88. It wasn't a ratings hit, never finishing in the year-end top 30 in a three-network TV universe, but won 13 Emmys among 62 nominations, including outstanding drama series in all of its seasons. Lloyd also was one of three Saint Elsewhere characters who appeared in a Cheers crossover episode, when the St. Eligius docs visited the bar where everybody knows your name. The shows debuted weeks apart on NBC. Watch Lloyd talking about being cast in St. Elsewhere below, as part of the Television Academy Foundation's The Interview series. During the 1970s, he earned Emmy nominations for the NBC adventure series The Name of the Game as a producer and telefilm Steambath as an EP. His numerous other TV credits range from guesting on the 1950s series Craft Theatre and One Step Beyond to such popular dramas as Night Gallery, Kojak, Wise Guy, Tales of the Unexpected, an early modern family episode, recurring on the practice and regular roles on the short-lived 1992 NBC comedy Home Fires and UPN's 1998-2001 sci-fi drama Seven Days. He also directed for such series as Chevron Theater, Omnibus, the adventures of Kit Carson and several TV movies during that genre's heyday in the 1970s. He also was executive producer of PBS, Hollywood Television Theater, 1970-78.